did not know that all dogs can't swim. Don't say we didn't teach you something here on City News. Uh, here's what I'm teaching you, or not even teaching you, but telling you now and showing you, looking west off the tower. Skies are just starting to get a little bit brighter after the round of showers that has gone through. Lightning right now is still well to the north of downtown. So here's the lightning tracker right now. So it's north and east. So uh, places like Scarborough, Markham, still into that lightning as well as eastward. So this, uh, the severe thunderstorm watch that's in effect will likely be dropped here very shortly. 21 degrees. I know it's still muggy, right? The humidex it still feels like the low 30s. That humidity will be dropping as we go through the night tonight. So we're starting to see a couple of spots like Niagara here and Prince Edward County dropped from the severe thunderstorm watch. Again, this is almost done, almost over with. So uh, still plan for some outdoor activities here as you go through the evening. There is a shot, though, at one cell. When we start to see the whites here, that's high reflectivity off the radar. It's reflecting off of something in that cloud a lot and it's likely some hail within that uh, cell that's there north of Markham and same deal with this uh, system right here this little storm core could be dropping some small hail along the shorelines of Lake Erie now the current humid X 26 but again it's going to be falling as we sleep tonight so the muggy meter for people like Michelle Mackey, I can, you know what? It's funny. I can see her in my top screen, and she's yeah, she, she's like, uh huh, yep. <laughs> you guys, will, you'll see her in about 30 seconds. Uh, humidity will be dropping here, so good hair tomorrow. And then it looks like that humidity is creeping back up here as we go into the weekend and into next week. So tomorrow morning, it's going to be uh, sunny and warm, a little bit of cloud as well. So lots of cloud cover tomorrow. It's a good photography day. Less humid, much more comfortable, but the humidity starts creeping up. Here's the deal. I know this looks really bad, right, for the long-range forecast. Uh, chance for showers and thunderstorms right throughout the weekend. Saturday, it will be through the afternoon. Sunday, it will be through the middle of the day. Looks like we'll have a dry start to the morning. And then Monday and Tuesday, I've put late-day storms, late-day storms. And there's the humid X there as we go through the next uh, seven days cooler at night. In fact, on Monday, we may see that temperature 27 falling a little bit. Uh, Thursday, you'll want to also pack an umbrella. Two things happening, and I actually just took a look at the latest forecast models. It's morning showers, but now an afternoon storm risk looks to be making a comeback as well for Thursday. So we'll be tracking that, of course, for you tomorrow. Mainly uh, cloudy and good hair day. Her, oh, wait, I can't even speak now. Good hair day for Michelle Mackey with that lower humidity tomorrow. Michelle.